Hey guys, this is Dan from iPadJailbreak.com. I have a iOS 7 Beta 2 installed on my iPad 2 that's sitting right here in front of you. And I was going to show you guys the panoramic photos um, that you can have as wallpaper. Um, again, you rotate. I have it on a uh, Lazy Susan again. As you can see, I'm just rotating it. And it brings that background. It rotates it around um, until you hit a point where at the end of the photo, then it just kind of stops. So right there, I bring it back around, it's based solely on the compass and the accelerometer. So if you bring it forward and back, it'll sometimes jump around. Um, you can also kind of get an up and down look effect on that too. So um, jump into your settings here and all your photos is just like your iPhone. Um, you just hit over your wall, brightness wallpaper, and then your panoramic photos jump into a separate folder. And you can just go ahead and select these. And uh, I don't know why this one came in, but anything with the dimensions of a panorama photo um, automatically fly in there. So you can select any one of these to be your wallpaper. And if, if you select it, it brings up, you know, it, it, pretty much a sample, so you can see what it what it will look like if it's if it's a high enough quality. Um, if you have the Retina iPad, it might not uh, look quite as good if it's not a full quality. You know, if it's not uh, 2048 by 2000, at least the minimum of that in uh, in the vertical direction. So anyway, I'm just rotating this around and show you what it looks like on your, uh, this is what it looks like on your home screen. So let me, let me back out here. My lock screen. I have a lock screen, screen is set for that already. And then you just can slide to unlock. You can see how nice the wallpaper is, how much more it's opened up. You can access control center right from here. Tap, you can extract your notification center as well. And uh, other than that, there is a uh, the another kind of photo that you can have in the background. It's a dynamic wallpaper. So you can select this right here. It'll give you a feel for what it will look like in the background. So I can set this to my home screen here. And then head back to my home screen. And you can see that you have a dynamic wallpaper with bubbles in the background. So there's only a couple selections for those. And also your stills, if I select this still wallpaper here, um, as you can see the 931, if you watch the stars move around a little bit, you can kind of see, um, and it gives them a little 3D look to them. Uh, let me go ahead and set it as my home screen. My problem with these buttons is they don't give you any, any indication if you actually pressed it. Anyway, if I rotate this around, it kind of looks like the icons jump off the page. It's the same effect that's included on the iPad or on the iPhone as well. So anyway, uh, that's pretty much all I had for you guys. Uh, just check us out at iPadJailbreak.com. And be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel at iPadJailbroken on YouTube. Thanks, guys.